On June 16, 2016, CERN, C-E-R-N, the European Organization for Nuclear Research in Geneva, started a project to accelerate charged particles. Ten days later, photographer Christoph Suarez posted a series of photographs of the skies above CERN. Those jaw-dropping photos showed the formation of strange clouds and were proof that the biggest experiment in the world is about to tear a portal into another universe open. Uh, what's going to happen next? Are we going to be destroyed or meet ourselves in another dimension? The strange clouds sparked a media frenzy regarding portals in the sky. Given that the LHC has found small black holes when smashing particles, which could suggest parallel universes and extra dimensions, what we previously saw could turn into a storm now that the CERN is even more powerful than before. Stephen Hawking, a renowned scientist, also warned us about the God Particle. He even bet Gordon Kane $100 that physicists couldn't discover the Higgs boson, but when they did, Hawking issued a stern warning. In his famous book, Starmus, the scientist claimed that the particle could one day be responsible for the destruction of the known universe. He wrote, The Higgs potential has the worrisome feature that it might become mega-stable at energies above 100 billion giga-electron volts. Here, the biggest concern about the destruction is the formation of small black holes that would expand and eventually decompose the world from within. Despite CERN scientists' assurances that these black holes would not destroy the universe, British astronomer Sir Martin Rees agrees with Hawking that they could open a Pandora's box, unleashing high-energy strange matter that is extremely unstable and causing a catastrophic vacuum decay that would cause time and space itself to collapse. Hawking warned that this could happen at any time and we wouldn't see it coming. CERN does that big circle. It accelerates particles in that big circle around and around and around and around until they're traveling at just enormous velocity and then they collide these particles together and in that moment it creates a moment that they think is kind of how the Big Bang started the whole universe. That's the whole purpose behind it. However, they also believe that there are parallel realities around us, other dimensions and there could be other intelligence there however there's a reason God put them on the other side of that veil and you might not want to open the door their own director of CERN has gave uh, uh, interviews to the British press in which he admits that's what they're trying to do they want to open a door to another dimension and he said when we open this door he said something might come through it into our reality or he said we might send something through it into their reality you can look that up it's in the British press